Good morning. <laughs> so in connection with the award that we're about to give for the best paper of the software engineering and practice track, I thought it would be nice to capture for the listeners a little bit about this track and why we're here and why we have this best paper award. So we're here at ICSI uh, 2013, and the SEIP is a particular track there. Maybe could you say a little bit about what's specifically different about SEIP? Yes, yes. well, SEIP track obviously is aimed towards having an industry presence and industry engagement at ICSI. And if you think about it, we're software engineers and we're interested not just in theoretical research, but the purpose of what we're doing is to really make a difference in practice and to help practitioners uh, maybe adopt some of the you know the new ideas and to have a an open exchange of ideas between practitioners and academics so i think one of the things we look for in the in the seip the practitioner track is examples and case studies of um of, of things that work in practice maybe some areas where there are challenges that mm -hmm. the industry people want to talk about and maybe attract researchers to help mm -hmm. them in those areas and then another really major thrust, I think, of the um, SEIP track is when we have some really good ideas that have emerged from, um, from academia, mm -hmm. and those ideas are coming to some kind of level of maturity, and we want to see, do they, do they actually work in industry? Do they scale up? Are they reliable enough? Can people use them? Do they actually solve the problem that people have set out to address. So I think the industry track creates this kind of forum for where, where academics and practitioners can meet and work on these problems together. Great, great. Thank you. That's really well said, actually. And I think, I mean, for all the reasons that you just described, I've always felt like this is a natural connection for IEEE software, since so many of the things that we worry about in terms of transitioning the research to the practitioners is exactly what the SEIP track is addressing here, too. I've been sitting in on a lot of the sessions here at Dixie, and it's been really quite exciting, actually. I mean, there's mm -hmm. been attendees from Google, from Lockheed Martin, from you know a lot of the companies, especially sitting here in Silicon Valley, as it was. Yes. Uh, and it seems like there's been a lot of extra uh, activities with SCIP on the on the agenda this year. Yes. Well, that was actually something that um, David Notkin, the general chair, was um, really had a vision for that for this Dixie because we are so close to Silicon Valley. Uh -huh. And um, one of the things that was quite fun this year is we had a um, Silicon Valley in industry tour. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people went and um, visited some of the great, um, great. some of the organizations there. And we've been able to have some tutorials. We have a special keynote, mm -hmm. and um, so I think all of these things are um, kind of like really contribute to making this a, a vibrant conference for practitioners to come come to and to kind of be renewed and to get new ideas and great, great. Yeah. excellent well it's I, it's been really exciting and i'm looking forward to giving out the award in a little bit it's yes. a it's a nice place to bring the the researchers and the the practitioners together and have that communication going on yes. so thank you jane for all the effort that you put into organizing it this year thank you thank you great. Great.